Hey, what's up, buddy? My name is Anamine, and today we're continuing on with some more OS battle spot battles, and uh, using the same team. I think I'm gonna use this team maybe two or three more episodes, something like that. But we're using Mega Charizard. Uh, why? I think I can't remember. To be honest with you guys, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. It's been a while. It's been a while <laughs> since I've sat down and played. Um, okay. So anyways, Con Calder. I think that's my assault vest, Con Calder. Uh, Citrus Berry, Belly Drummond, Azumarill, we have a Toxic Stalling, Umbreon, we have Galvantula with Sticky Webs, Focus Sash, and we have a, a, I think it's, I can't remember if it's my Life Orb or my Black Sludge, uh, Rose, uh, Rose Raid. I, I don't remember. Huh. I think it's a Life Orb. I'm pretty sure it's Life Orb. I'm going with life orb. Anyways, let's gonna let's go let's, let's go ahead and challenge someone to find ourselves a battle, a battle. If you guys have uh, you know any suggestions for um, you know a, a team or a Pokemon that I could base my te a, a team around, feel free to leave them down in the comments section below, and uh, I'll do my best to do that. I still need to like make a team around um, Bush Cash. Brought a shiny Bush Cash. I still haven't used it. Alright, so, wow, okay, okay, alright, so we're fucked. I have to bring nothing but power to win this. Excuse me. Excuse me, excuse me. So, uh, blah, blah, blah. so we have Latios, I think. <laughs> Cloyster, Blaziken, Skarmory, Water War, and Lantern. Um, scurry? Quite scurry? I honestly, I'm thinking, I am thinking, Charizard, Azumarill, and Conkelder, because that's just a power team. I was kind of hoping to not have to resort to that and try to, and be able to branch out to something, because uh, Conkelder can has Ice Punch, can uh, take care of that Latios, um, and uh, Azumarill can hopefully take out that uh, Blaziken there. I mean, unless it has like Thunder Punch or something, it could have Thunder Punch. I think it can land Thunder Punch or Thunder Kick. Maybe is that even a fucking move? I don't know. Uh, I feel like though I should lead it with. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. I feel like I should lead in with Zoomerill. Uh, should I? Yeah. Then I'm just trying to think because the only thing like Rose Raid can really do is come in on Lantern, maybe even closer, but that's pushing it. Uh, Galvantula. Uh, it depends on the Lantern if it's Volt Absorb or not. Um, um, Brion, I, I kind of don't want to bring it because, like I said, it's talk to Stall, and if she brings the, or, or he brings the Skarmory, then fuck. I only did with a Zoom Reel, uh, because it's fast, uh, and confirm. I have a feeling Radios is going to lead, if not Blaziken, Speed Boost Blaziken. Uh, so a Zoom Reel should be, uh, good to scare either one of those two out. Ooh. Alright, let's do this. I'm gonna lead in with Latios. Or Latios, sorry. So I'm leading with Azumarill. I'm going to uh, scare this fucker out completely uh, with a player off. I'm not even going to fuck. Should I, should I fuck around and just go for the belly drum? Like, or can this thing learn, like, Thunderbolt or something just for me? That's what I'm scared about. And the next question is am I faster? I don't know. I think I should not dick around and just go for the player up. I feel like I feel, uh, I'm gonna regret this. Just go for the player up. It's gonna use trick. We're gonna switch items here. Okay, it's a good thing I didn't because he would have taken my citrus berry. So I got choice specs. That's fine. That's fine. I locked myself into uh, player up, but it is gonna be enough to take this thing down. Didn't even get a chance to use that citrus berry. Uh, but it's good because it would have locked me into belly drum. And it would have forced me to switch out. That's what he was probably, or she was probably hoping for. Uh, Alright, so in comes a steel type. We obviously don't want to stay in, in, in here at all. We do not want to stay in here at all. Uh, so I'm going to go into Charizard here. I feel like that's my best bet. He's probably going to go for either still have rocks or spikes. So I might as well get to switch in now. All right, so he's gonna go for toxic. Fuck, fuck. If I went out into uh, Kong Kelder, it would have got a nice gust boost, but it doesn't matter. A brave bird probably would hurt a lot on the Kong Kelder. So 
Charizard, poisoned. Obviously, we're going to Mega Evolve, and we're, uh, we're just going to flat out go for the, the Fire Blast. Do we predict uh, another Pokemon, like um, Lantern? Do we predict the Lantern? I don't think we do. I think we just go for the Fire Blast, play it safe. I do have... Uh, do I have something to help take out that Lantern? Oh yeah, Solar Beam, so... Um, do I have anything else? Not really, to be honest. I mean, Kong Kelder might be able to do something. So as long as we don't miss this, we should take him down to sturdy. Maybe we'll get a burn on this? What is it? I think it's like a 10% chance to burn on that. Come on, burn the fucker. <laughs> Rock Tomb, this is gonna hurt like hell. Probably enough to take me out. Oh, oh, not enough. Not enough. So I think what I'm gonna do is just go for a very, very safe, um, safe move here and just take out this little biatch here. Do I go for the Solar Beam here? It's gonna be 1 HP. Then I, and I believe Solar Beam is 100% accurate. Accurate? Accurate. Let's go for the Solar Beam here. Unless he has a priority, that's gonna suck. But I don't think he does, right? No. So we're just gonna go for the Solar Beam here. Just because it's 100% accurate. First turn used because of this uh, drought's up, the sun's up. And it's just gonna take this thing out. And even if he did swap... Probably would have done at least neutral damage to it anyways. What is his last Pokemon? We're going to lose Charizard here next turn. Ooh, this is scary. Maybe we'll just sack off Charizard to get some damage off and get a free switch into our next Pokemon. I think that's the plan. Guardivar. Uh, are we going to... Are we going to uh, outspeed this thing? I really hope we do. I really hope... I really, really, really hope we do. I'm going to just go for the Fire Blast here and pray we don't miss. I'm also going to pray that we are faster. I don't know. So, we'll see. Now, I'm trying to think of how I'm going to deal with this thing. If this Fire Blast does not kill it, which I don't think it will, because usually these things are very specially defensive, right? Okay. Side Shock, which is going to be more than enough, to, way more than enough to take out this Charizard, or my Charizard. And even if it didn't, the poison would have. Alright, so I'm glad we, we were faster there. Oh, excuse me. Um... Wait. Let me check the moves. I always forget my moves. Okay, we have Mock Punch. I don't think Mock Punch is going to be enough to take that thing out. The only thing that's going to be able to hit it for neutral damage is Ice Punch. And at Water War, it's definitely faster. So I'm going to go to, into Azumarill here. Um, go into Azumarill. I have to remember, though, I am Choice spec Because the uh, the Trick Swap. I mean, I, you know what? Aqua Jet should be more than enough to kill this thing. Aqua Jet should be... Oh, wait, no! Because the sun is up. Oh, fuck me. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me right now? This is gonna hurt. <laughs> That's okay. That's okay. We don't live it, but, but, but we do have Mach Punch. So as long as this bitch doesn't have something priority like Shadow Sneak. Can they even learn Shadow Sneak? I don't know. Even if, the, even if that thing could learn Shadow Sneak, that's gonna do dick all to me. I'm just gonna go for the Mach Punch here, get the priority hit. And, uh, and win this thing. There we go. We won. Oh, yeah. This team is so powerful. At least these, this, this three. These three team on a, a 3v3, uh, is actually really powerful and really scary to come across. Uh, I'm liking it. So I'm probably going to do another two battles, one or two battles with this team. Uh, maybe, hopefully in the next episode, we'll use one of the other team members i mean i think we've only ever used rouge raid i don't think we've used umbreon or galvantula at all them. mainly because we never really had an opportunity to use the other team members i don't know maybe that's just me but anyways guys thank you for watching i hope you guys enjoyed if you did make sure you hit the like button for me it shows your support for the channel and it shows your support for the series and i do do appreciate it and of course don't forget to click the subscribe button if you haven't already and as always Stay today. Yeah.